Greetings, my fellow sapiens. It is I, Lord Avasari Omega, and I'm back. Master of Games, Rule of the Ch Dimension of Challenges, etc., etc. We're back with more Pokemon. Yes? <laughs> yes, indeed. So, we are in, uh, we are on Iron Island, so we are going to continue our explorations here. Hello, sir. You are? I'm Lord Omega. He is Riley. Aha. Hello, Riley. I'm a trainer, and yes, it's a bit odd I will be training here. If you'd like, we could team up. The wild Pokemon here are restless. Uh, apparently, I decided to go with him. Okay. If Pokemon get hurt, I'll heal them. Oh, that is actually... Oh, it's a the double thing. Okay. I see. I understand now. Okay. Very well. And double battles. All right. Beating will be my 100th straight win. Here's to a fun battle. I'll pound the fear of my fist into you all karate style, punk. Call me a punk. I see. Well, all right. Battle with Helen Black. Oh, well. Meta Charm and Krogunk. Ooh. Ooh, Lucario. Ooh, very nice. Uh, Krogunk is very similar to to me, so I'm going to try Cross Poison on the Medicham. Ooh, nasty. And we are victorious, it looks like. Krogunk is what? Fighting poison? If I remember correctly? Well, we heal back every battle, so... Yes, yes. Ooh, paralyzed. Very nice. <laughs> How will use cross poison? Oh, we get we get our move points back after the refight too. All right, that is. I did not realize that this healing would restore move points as well. Interesting. Very well. There's an item up here, huh? A magnet. That one those boosts electric moves, I think. Okay, there is... I thought so. Iron plate. Yeah, I thought there would be a hidden item there. I have a better of a plate. Draws from the plate that holds. You put the iron plate... Okay. All right.
Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, da, da, da. Double Graveler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Night Slash, sure. Uh, yeah, whack. Did not crit on that one. No, we took one out. Good. We took one out before it could move. That's good. Yes. And he exploded. Not very impressively, I might I may say. I mean, I'm much higher level, so I'm not surprised. This place is very large, actually. Interesting. Okay. An Ultra Ball? All right. I mean, we may as well fight them. It's worth it. It is worth the experience points, honestly. That hurts. Mario, you could use a move that does something. Mario, you have moves that do damage. I know this. Ah, X Scissor. Okay. It is okay. It's just a high damaging bug move. That doesn't miss. That normal attack. It will we'll swap it out. Pin missile out for it. Yes. I would rather have a move that was uh, how you say uh, high crit, but we'll take this for now. Yes, 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 yes. I want to check something here. I'm taking a quick look. I want to take a quick look to see... I want to see what, what fairy types there are in this, this one. Alright, um... So Jigglypuff is one of very few. That and Mime, that and Mime Jr. Interesting. So, Azuril, Maril, Cliffa, Clefairy, Igglybuff, Jigglypuff, and Mime Jr. Okay, so I've got two of the only fairy types in this particular game. Okay. Thunder Wave. Uh, what is Thunder Wave? Oh, that's the Paralysis move. That is a very good move, actually. 
Honestly, I don't think he needs Volt Switch, so yes. Thunder Wave is actually an extremely useful move. Interesting. It's not a double battle here. Interesting. Okay. Huh. So I guess if I want to use a fairy type and I want to have diversity on my team, I either pretty much have to run uh, Jigglypuff, probably. Uh, not Jigglypuff. Uh, Clefairy. Or uh, we drop we drop Manaphy for Mario. Hmm. There's another Machoke. Uh, switch Pokemon. Jirachi, get out there. Hmm. An interesting uh, has an interesting idea. Interesting. So I think in question, I'm supposed to have come in sort of in a better direction to trigger the fight, but whatever. Zubat, okay. Night Slash is what we want on him from here. out Manaphy for this. Alright. Actually, I've got a very good move for him, I believe, actually. Yes, Ice Beam is... Nope. Wrong, wrong button. Well, whatever. This is what we like to call Overkill. It is unfortunate Manaphy could not learn Thunderbolt. That would have been very nice for him. I definitely would keep him then. Because then he'd be able to have a water and ice and a thunder move a lightning move. Along with Tail Glow. Which strikes me as something that would have been very handy, I think. But they saw that coming, I think. <laughs> I don't know why I thought to look there. That would be insane. Yes. <laughs> Fortunate. From a balanced standpoint, you can't do that. And I'm, I think that's for the best. Okay. 
But it would have been fun, yes. <laughs> Let's get Manaphy out there. We're going to want Manaphy, I think. Nice. And to Lucario. Well, all right. Should have hit the other one, I think, actually, uh, now that I'm thinking on it. Paralysis is good, yes. I mean, hit the right one, actually. Ooh, Steelix. This is unfortunate for you, Onyx. There we go. Very good. And Jirachi leveled up. Nice. Graveler, I see. This item over here. A max potion, huh? And a random encounter. Shocking! It's a graveler and an onyx. What? How? How could that ever have seen that? All right, I think I know what I need to do here, and I should have done this a while ago. But we'll do this in a moment. Uh, let's try Texas or an onyx. What the? What the heck? Want to see what the animation was like. Well, that was unfortunate. For the Graveler! <laughs> Alright, um... Yes, yeah, Wapanak, I know you're bored, but uh, just finish him off, would you? Right here. Ah, there you go. All right, gold bat and onyx. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, we got the crit. Very nice.
irritating, but whatever. Alright. Uh, Why are you worried, Scorponaki? He is uh, a pushover, as it were. There we go. See? Easy. Easy, I say. <laughs> Alright, and we move on. Alright, forward. More fights here. Yes, 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 yes. I did it again. I forgot to make a swap. Ah, one moment. Uh, I'm going to. Yeah, we can't. All right. Ah, uh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, all right. I've got a lot of levels on um, Watson. I'm thinking what the correct move would be to swap him out now for someone I want to le work on leveling. I don't know why I didn't think of that earlier. I did. I thought of it a little while ago, and then nope, nope, no, 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 no. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Ah, goddamn it! I miss, I misclicked. And I'm thinking it should be my Jigglypuff. Not my Jigglypuff, um... Clefairy, that's it, yes. Not Lucario, the Graveler. Can't believe I misclicked like that. <laughs> that way, if I want to use the Fairy, I can. Like, yeah. Yes, we should do that. I think that's the, that is the correct move. Uh, Pokemon... Yeah, Watson's 48. Like, yeah, we, we can... We don't need Flash right now. Yeah, so, uh... Swap Pokemon. Not swap. Uh, there we go. Rod boxes. There we go. And I think we want to work on leveling Clefairy. I think. This is a decent Clefairy. I forget. Neutral stats. Okay. And it's a cute charm. is a fun move. All right. Oh, right. It's got actually a pretty good suite of moves, too. Holy shit. She's probably really good against... Looking at that, that looks like she might be actually really good against dragons. With both Ice Beam and Dazzling Gleam. Self-heal. Yeah, maybe. Maybe we... Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe, yes. Like, I think there are a couple of dragon trainers in the game, in there, right? Late game, there's like at least one trainer who specializes in dragons, yes? A good, that's a good. That was a good idea for a move there by the by the computer. Specializing a couple of random trainers in Victory Road, the champion has one dragon. Okay, good to know. Also, I think it's probably just... She looks like she's actually fairly well set up to be just good all around. So... Like, I don't know how good her stats are is the problem.
We'll take a look at their stats in the second tier. So, like, she, yeah, her stats are, she's got low speed, that's her one drawback. And okay defenses, okay attack, and decent hit points. Alright. We need to level her up, though, that's the thing, so I think, nope, not there. Alright, uh, ah! Like, I need these experience points, but I should probably put somebody else up front, I'm thinking now. Like, if I want to speed up these fights, I think... Yeah, we're going to... I'm going to make this... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll do this. Handle this now, this here, but... I should put Manafi up front here, I think. Down here. I think that's the correct move. And the whack. Yes, good shot. Breaking Sand Tomb. Alright. Well, um... Yes. Well, I am double Sand Tombed. That seems poor. Looks like it'll only be affected by one. Alright. In that case... Just follow me. No. Yes, I wish to give up on follow me. Yes. I, I the idea of a tanking move is interesting. I'm just not sure it's the it's a good idea here. Um oh, that's dead end. Alright, so in that case, oop, let me go this way. Again, I forgot to make the swap who's in front ah, for crying out loud. Why am I ugh? Alright, so... Scorponok, you Night Slash the Golbat. It lived. Oh, That's irritating. Well, the Graveler is paralyzed. At least that's something. No, I, uh, I hit the wrong button again. Well, whatever. Not a big deal. I did not the wrong button, but I changed the target without meaning, without thinking about it. I just did it for some reason. I do not know why. All right, so... check something here before I do something else. Oh, okay. Wait, ah, I almost forgot again. Ha! I remembered now. Manafi. Swap. There we go. That will be better. See, much better. Now we have someone who's out fast who will be able to just one-shot these things. Well, outside of sturdy, but uh, there's an only so much one can be done that can be done about that. See, sturdy. <laughs> Learns Water Pulse at 46. Alright, uh... 
Oh, well, they both exploded. Okay. That speeds this up. What interesting special moves can, what moves can he learn? I'm sort of looking at other optional moves to give to Manafi beyond, uh... What the, so... I, the, water, water... Yeah, so anyways, uh, yes, Bubble Beam, I think, yeah, yes. Let me take a look at his moves. So he will eventually learn Water Pulse, which will probably replace Bubble Beam, I'm guessing. Water Pulse seems weaker than Bubble Beam. Right. Uh. So, all right. Water pulse not very, not very good for man. If we will keep, we keep up with over that. Um, arguably, could use scald instead though, and I do have that. All right. The question is, oh, we could teach it shadow ball. That would give it a ghost move. That's possible. I have that TM. All right. I'm sort of looking at what to replace, uh... Eventually I might replace Charm with something. I'm thinking, I'm thinking Shadow Ball might be the move there. If we don't have any ghosts, anybody who has ghost moves in the team currently, I think that might be the right move. Good job, Manafi. So yes, that does 60, Bubble Beam does 65. I think I'd rather have, I think I would rather have Bubble Beam. Yes. Uh, I might replace that with Scald. I think Scald hits harder. Planning ahead, as it were. <laughs> I clicked on the wrong target, damn it! Well, it hit him anyways, okay. Good. And that one did not have sturdy. Oh, good. Right, right. And a, a Geo dude. Ha! Huh. Not see one of those in here yet. So yes, I think Shadow Ball might be the right move since I already have some with Fairy move. That's 30. And hopefully Lucario used the move. Yes, good Lucario. Very good. Titanium level 
leveled up again. Good. She is catching up. That is good. Tough Pokemon, tough trainers, you tell me. Where else can I find a place as good as this to train? We battle your Pokemon will become stronger, and so will mine. That's a good thing for both of us. What's that like? Let's throw down. I see. Well, I'm going to Ice Beam the uh, Plipper. Ah, uh, no, the Plipper is part of water, so yeah, we'll just Bubble Beam the Ponita first. Yes, that's not very good against Plipper. Haunter! Ooh! You know what? I'm going to tail glow. Ha! Manaphy dodged! Very good! See, well, um, one moment, Floatzel. All right. Okay with Screech. Oh, Screech is regular defense. I'm not that excited by that, but that's okay. Sudo Wudo! Well, um... Wow, that was fast. Oh, it's a Aqua Jet Day goes first, goes first move. That's right. <laughs> Very good, yes. I can Dude, you have moves that do damage. I don't. I mean, I, I guess. I mean, uh, okay, fine. I mean, neither of these are very effective against him. Is the problem? I'd rather not swap. So yeah. <laughs> Okay, I was not expecting that. Um, although, actually, that's with the tail glow, I sh probably should have expected something along those lines. Ah, I see. We are at the oh, Team Galactic, of course. I guess now you're responsible for the Pokemon. I don't care what good reason you may have. I don't want you bringing any trouble into mine. We are Team Galactic. We'll take all the Pokemon we want. Isn't that right, partner? We're abducting all the Pokemon from this rusted out Iron Island. To share in all the joys and all the sorrows. That's how trainers and Pokemon live in Sinnoh. I won't allow anyone to defy that code of ethics. You know what just occurred to me? Riley's hat makes him look a bit like a Murkrow. All 
right? He's got the Murkrow colors and feathers in the back of the hat. And yeah. Fine, I'm doing setup. I'm not worried by either of his po their Pokemon, so... Oh, ho, 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 ho. Poison me, that's annoying. Ah, let's nail the Krogunk. It's more annoying. Jirachi is 46 now. Very good, Jirachi. Oh, confusion. That's irritating. Yes, yes. <laughs> Another Zubat. Oh, we set out my confusion. That's excellent. Very good. Excellent work there. Tani is 38, good. Ah, he does have an evolved Pokemon. It's not going to help him, but he has one, which is nice. I said, stop, your combination is so sick. The both of you, you and your Pokemon. Let's be the partner. You said the brother. We don't even know if team, what Team Galactic's big plan is anyway. Can you help me out? Let's have Pokemon here. Would you take it with you? Uh, yes. Oh, that's great. I can just send it to the... Oh. <laughs> I can send it to the box. Great. I should add it to the party now? Uh, not right now. We will do that later. Send it to the box. It was very enjoyable. I tend to test my skills in other places from now on. Let's meet again. Take care on the way out. Riley's hat is nice. I like it. It's, it's a good hat. He has a good hat. Oh, there's an item there. What is the item? Give me an item. Nope. Eh, okay, well, we will smite the Onyx. I think I can guess what is probably in the the, uh, the egg he gave me. At the guess, it's, uh... It's, it's the, the young version of Lucario. Which... If I wasn't using, if I was not using either Chirachi or, uh, or, um, what's the Michigi, um, uh, my, uh, my Infernape, uh, those two both, yeah, one's Steel and the other is, fight, is fighting, so it's like, ah! 
From what I understand, Jirachi's, uh, uh, Lucario's very good. Like, very good. Ah, the shiny stone! Fantastic! Alright, we can evolve Rosaria. Uh, Rosarade. And we are back. We have done the island. Okay. Lucario is great with his versatility. Check to see if there's no move you still don't still want. Yeah, that's what I was sort of thinking. Um, also, again, like I'm not 100% certain I want to keep it, but uh, let's see. Roselia. What does she pick up uh, going forward? Uh, all right, the only question is whether I want to get Petal Dance at 60. Uh, Rose Raid. Does Rose Raid Luna lose after this or no? Yes, okay, so Rose Raid. Uh, Alright, Rosalia learns... No, I'm sorry, I'm looking at the wrong one. Alright, uh... Okay, so I can move Tutor, uh... Pedal... I can move Tutor... Move Tutor Petal Dance on if I wanted to. Or Petal Blizzard. All right, yeah, Petal Dance is 60, or I can move to the back with a hard scale. So yes, it is, if I wanted Petal Dance, I could get it with, uh, from the Move Tutor, it looks like. Petal Blizzard, Petal Dance, yes. Um, other moves that she learns before, that she would learn would be Aromatherapy, Ingrain, and then Petal Dance is 60, and then she's done. Question I have is I'm going to take a look at my take a look at the Pokemon. I'm going to rest everybody up for what I like to call obvious reasons. And while I can do it from the normal menu, we I can do it from here too, so let's do it. Let's see. I want to take a look. Summary. I want to take a look here. Uh, do I have anybody with the one of the abilities that makes hatching eggs faster? Is the question. I don't think so. Nope. 
We do not have the move that makes hatching faster. All right. Normally a fire type, yes. I only have a couple of fire types, so. I don't believe Inferno has it, correct? No, Blaze is not one of them. Nope. All right, that's fine. Magby in the underground. I was planning on going to the underground soon anyways, so... We might go do that in a minute. I think I want to do the gym here first, though. We can hatch the egg later. Like, that's not a huge rush. Um, all right. Let's go talk to the, the dude in front and find out what type this gym is. Alright, what type is this gym? Steel type Pokemon, okay. Hmm, interesting. I think... Oh, before I forget, I need. there's a couple things I want to do. Uh, bag, yes, TMs. I would not want to teach Iron Tail to anyone right now. Brian. Uh, no, Brian is me. Shadow Claw? No. Shadow Ball? Grass move. That's a, grass not as interesting, but not what I really want. Um, he's the father of the first gym leader. Interesting. Okay. I thought I had Shadow Ball, but I might not. Toxic. Yeah, bullet Seed. No. Work up. Sunny day. You got the I have another Thunderbolt one, which is nice to have, but not needed. Um, wait. Titania can learn Thunderbolt. That gives her, like, nearly perfect coverage, you know? Interesting. We'll sweep. Dig. Oh, no, I do have Shadow Ball. I thought I did. All right, I'm going to teach I want to teach Shadow Ball to Manaphy. We'll lose Chan for Shadow Ball. That gives him Bubble Beam, Ice Beam, and Shadow Ball, which gives him good coverage overall. I think. And if I can find. Um I can find the TM for, uh, what is it called, uh, Scald. Then that would be ideal, I think. Yeah, we do not have Scald, okay. Now, I wonder if everything in here is steel or not. 
All right, we're going to start with... Okay, what is Steel vulnerable to? Steel is, like, good, very good against some stuff and sort of mediocre against... Is, like, very strong against some things and very weak to others, if I remember correctly. What is it? Let's see, it is... Weak to fighting, fire, and ground? All right. In that case, uh, oh well, that oh that means this is oh oh okay. Inferna, this is your this is your time to shine, my friend. Seal is an unbending spirit. If you never give up, the path to victory reveals itself. Okay. Let's just throw a mock punch. We about so bad so badly at level it. A lot of hit points, okay. Ice Fang was a very poor choice against me. I mean Steelix has a lot of hit points. Take a look at. Hang on. Pokemon. Titania. It's like ice. Pe like I could give her. Um. Like Thunderbolt there. And she would have coverage, she would have basically perfect coverage, nearly perfect coverage then, huh? Though she does favor special, so I want her to place Meteor Mash with something that goes off special. Alright, this is a... A gym with a bunch of things that go up and down, it looks like. Only about seeing how tough your Pokemon is. It's much deeper than that. Test of you as a person! Oh, okay. Ooh, a regular Onyx. Interesting. I guess that makes sense since there are somewhat Steelixes here. Hiya! I mean, yes, it was devastating. Alright, um... Oh, this is a gym where... Okay, we have to, it's a puzzle gym, we have to go up and down and... Oh, okay, I see. Alright. Um, actually, before we continue this further, uh, it is a good time to take a break, so... We'll be breaking things up here. One moment. There we go. All right, so those of you who are watching us on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying. We'll be back soon with the, the next part. Um, but if you're watching, we recorded this live on twitch.tv slash mechagm. Uh, and uh, yes, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, uh, subscribe. The bell button thingy means you get alerted more often or what have you. Uh, we'll be back in the near future with more of this. And I uh, hope you had fun. See you soon. Bye-bye.